pieces as well. I say in order to, um, this is me, part of my walk is I do my best to walk in integrity. Uh, your integrity as a medium is to leave your ego at the door, to set the little mind aside. I'm a conscious trance medium. That means I'm always on the outside going, oh, that's interesting. Whoa, I didn't know that. Oh, fascinating. Like when someone asked me, you know, I had a client once that was incredibly paranoid. And when he asked me if his cell phone was being tapped, I told him yes. And then I could see that all the cell phones were being tapped. And this was like five years ago. And I could see that it all, like, all went up to like this big satellite. I said, it's being tapped, but you know, no one's like really listening. But I was like, whoa, all those conspiracy theories. Oh, because I didn't have other people asking me those. You know, If people ask me specific things, I'll go there and see if I can get the information. Um, so your question was, was it that widespread about her um, and that is ego. I think that uh, I just heard it through the grapevine that Ramtha was uh, telling people that Jay-Z Knight had, was buying Arabian horses and telling people as Ramtha that they really ought to buy that horse. It was a good investment. Just felt fishy to me. And your other question was? Well, I think you already answered it with respect to ego. Yeah, it's, it's about ego, leaving your ego at the door. That's, uh, it's uh, the, the more you surrender. But, but Rontha did come back. I, I believe that he's come back, uh, yeah, because uh, Rontha's on what the bleep do we know. But I haven't really been in touch. I believe that he's come back. Sometimes you learn your lessons hard. Sometimes you learn them easier. Depends on how important that particular lesson is for you to learn. <sighs> yes. Okay. Um, I was just wondering, I've, I've been having things disappear in my house and are lost or something. Is that just misplacing or is there something else going on, do you think? Um, among spiritualist circles, one member of your band is always the joy guide. And the joy guide, uh, generally manifests as a uh, small child or sometimes it's a troop, you know. And, they, uh, and their whole job is to uh, remind you to take yourself lightly. <laughs> and so when you get too analytical and when you get really fixed on having to do certain <laughs> things a certain way, joy guides can move things. Yeah. It can 